Hello everybody and welcome back to Jazzy61. So today's video is a grocery haul, you guys. I'm gonna show you my Walmart stuff is right here. I'm gonna put the other clips of the other part of my grocery haul in here as well. I know how I was gonna put it in order. It's gonna be behind this one. So I wanna say hello if you are new here. My name is Jazz. I do everything motherhood, lifestyle, a little bit of beauty every now and again. We're not gonna pull it off. Not today though, not today. Today, today, today I'm Peter Cottontail, okay? Got my little puff. It shrunk, I'm okay with that. I'm gonna do it later. <laughs> I post on Mondays and Fridays at 4.30 p.m. Central Standard Time. And I would love it if you would join the Jazzy 6-1 family. The Jazzy 6-1 family. There it is. I talk too fast. My apologies. <laughs> and to my returners and my new subscribers, hello guys. Welcome back. I hope you all enjoyed this video. So we're gonna go ahead and get to the grocery haul. So starting down here with my bread and my produce, you guys. I have some hot dog buns because I've been wanting to make chili cheese dogs. So I got some buns for that. We got some tortilla shells for tacos or chicken tacos or something like that got hamburger buns because we're going to be making grilling some stuff so got hamburger buns you got this bread has become my new favorite it's almost it's not like sweet but it's not i don't know it's really good it's really good so i've been using this on my sandwiches my husband's been eating it as well so we got the pepperidge farm hearty white bread here we have a bushel of bananas here at the back some blueberries, some rom uh, romaine lettuce, romaine, romaine lettuce, a bushel, you call it a head, all that. Romaine lettuce, we have yellow bell peppers, red bell peppers, green bell peppers up here. Some baby carrots for a roast, some mint, because you guys know I make tea every morning. So I picked up two more things of the organic mint for my tea. We have five Roma tomatoes. These are good for like everything. So. I got Roma tomatoes, some asparagus back here. I'm not sure what I think of it just yet, but asparagus, I'll, I'll figure something out with it. Who knows? Mushrooms, you guys know we eat mushrooms on everything. So I got another thing of mushrooms and some ginger root. Now I didn't think I got this much ginger root, you guys, but I got a lot of ginger root. My husband wanted some, he asked me about it the other day. And so I got some ginger root, but it's like a lot in this bag. It's all good, we're gonna use it. And a honeydew melon back here. Um, once it starts getting warm, guys, we start breaking out the honeydews and the golden honeydews. I love them, so got a honeydew melon. Up here towards the front, we have a queso block as well as three cans. Why am I over here where I need to be over here? Tripping. We've got a queso block. <laughs> we got three cans of diced tomatoes with green chilies as well as a can of tomato paste. Behind it, we have some orange juice as well as some more of the mango pineapple, simply tropical juice. You guys, it's really good. So we got some more of it. This turned out to work really well for me. This um, Parmesan cheese here. I told you guys last time I got Kraft usually and they haven't had it, but this worked really well this last time. So I got another container of it as well as some natural peanut butter. Um, when I cook with peanut butter, this is what I use because it has less sugar than the other stuff move on over to the side here over here we have a gallon of milk as well as some gatorades i wanted the the grape ones but they didn't have them so i got these instead which they're perfectly fine. i like the fruit punch ones as well yeah they had my waffles again which i got them by the box and my son ate some of them too so i went ahead and got another box of the birthday cake waffles because i just really like these things i think a couple people actually tried them as well let me know in the comments you guys if you tried these waffles and you like them let me know down below. So here we have some Gogurt, Strawberry Splash, and Cool Cotton Candy. I love these little things. I like the cotton candy ones. Um, I thought they'd be really good for my for my munchkin as well to try. So I got some of these Gogurts. We also got the regular, regular Yoplait yogurt for my husband and I. And then my son Stony Pool Organic Kid Yogurt and Strawberry Banana. Over here to the back, they finally had the pancake mix. And I think I was right. They took the um they did change the they rebranded so they finally got stuff back on the shelf so i got some more pancake mix and some trick cereal so we're trying to get my son to try different textures and things like that and i figured the tricks cereal would be really good for him so i got a box of trick cereal i wanted some nutter butters and i was looking at sam's and they only had them in like the mixed boxes with like oreos or you know, chocolate chip cookies, and I didn't want those other two. So instead, I just got these from Walmart. I'm really excited to eat them because I haven't had them in a while, but I've been really wanting something sweet, but not too sweet. Yeah, got those. We got my husband some more ripe plantain. You guys know he's been really, really enjoying these. 
He eats them like every day. I'm not kidding. He'll wake up in the morning and eat some of these before he goes to work, things like that. And then he'll eat it in the evening again just because. So I got him five more boxes of his plantain. And then these are my son's pouches. Um, these are apple, mango, raspberry, and oatmeal and avocado. This one is mango, peach, carrot, sweet potato, and oatmeal. And then this one is fruit and yogurt, strawberry, banana. We were getting the other one, but he seems to like these more. So I picked up these instead. And then we also got some soft food. Um, this is sweet potato here. And then this one is new. This is uh, banana, carrot, and mangoes. He likes all those things. So we're gonna see if he's gonna eat those or not. And then back here, we have his waters. We got three cases of his water because as I said, you guys, we've been going through some water. Now I do mean we've been going through some water in my house. So we got my son three more containers of his water and then I got three more of ours as well the third one's on the floor I didn't feel like picking it up I'm gonna be honest with you guys so I got <laughs> three more cases of water each for us all now this section is a little bit different because of the fact that we got some things from Sam's Club that um pretty much canceled out the other stuff that I would normally get here the only thing that's like really different is this so we've been looking for lamb at Sam's they have not had any lamb now our local Walmart does sell lamb so we got I got a couple from there I usually like the ones from Sam's Club better. They taste better for some reason. Um, there's like a, a gamier kind of lingering taste to the ones I get from Walmart. So we'll see how these go. So we got three things of lamb. One of them only has two in them. So for what we normally get, um, this is a lot less because I think at Sam's they're like like 15 to 18 dollars for one can take one case, you know. So. I don't know. We will see how this turns out for us. It's only like eight pieces of lamb, which is <laughs> less than what we normally do, but it's all good. So I got some lamb um, loin chops for us that go to the hot dogs for the turkey dogs. Now, normally, like I said, I get the, um, I get sausage and turkey bacon and things like that. But we went to Sam's and my husband found some turkey sausage instead. So there's a big box of turkey sausage. You guys see that at the end of the video. And then I got some more honey roasted turkey breasts as well as some stew meat because I cooked one of the ones that I had in my freezer. So here are the few items that I got that are not grocery related, you guys. Um, I needed some more tablets. When I plan and things, I like to write it out. I'm one of those people, like, my husband's like start doing spreadsheets, but for some reason, I just have to like write it down. I don't know, I, I've always been that way. If I write it down, I feel like it's more real. I understand it better. So I always write it, even if I type it somewhere, I have to rewrite it down and redo the numbers and things in my head. So I got myself some more tablets so that I can do that. Let me know in the comments if you're one of those people that have to write everything down. I don't know <laughs> if I'm the only one that's like that, but I have to write everything down. Up here, I got some more scented trash bags. These are lavender and these are lemon, which you guys know, we use them for stinky diapers and pick up poops when we take our dog for walks because we do pick up poops you guys we don't leave poops around our neighborhood i think that's not very nice that's all i'm saying um i got some staples because i bought a stapler and i forgot to buy staples so i got a staple some staples there we do have um some more swisper rounds i like these better the exfoliating ones because one side is like really rough and i can get into my skin good and get it clean the ones i have now are just like smooth i think that's more for like application of like um uh, oils or things like that to your skin because it's just going to get on the surface a little bit but I like these to get into my skin and this you guys my girl Gail hey girl hey my girl Gail um told me about these so you guys know I love the downy um April Fresh scent laundry beads right she was like they have them as a plug-in they have them as like wax melts too but I didn't know that and she was like yeah girl so she sent me a little thing and I got some. I told her she got me out here just spending money. Just spending money over here, but it's all good. Um, because I like to make my house smell good. I like the, the fresh scents in my home. Um, and I do candles and I have a diffuser. There's my diffuser going over there right now, you guys. Um, but I love, love, love the plugins. So I picked up the um, plug for it because I didn't have one that fit the two headed thing. <laughs> so I did pick up a plug for it, you guys. And I am just, I'm really really amped up about using it I'm not gonna pretend i'm so excited to use this Alrighty, you guys so i'm gonna go ahead and get this food put away and i'm gonna start processing uh, my fruits and things so that they are ready to go for me to eat over this next week so let's go ahead and get started with that 
So now I'm going to go ahead and start some of this food prep and put away. I'm going to put the strawberries in a bowl and rinse them off a few times to get as much of the dirt off as I can. As well as put these blackberries into a strainer and rinse them as well. Then I'm going to slice everything up, put it into this little bowls and get it all stored away. I also do this with the yogurts and things like that that we have. All of it fit perfectly into this tray. Um, including the couple that I had left over from the last time. So I'm going to go ahead and be quiet and let you guys enjoy this organization and food prep motivation. And I'm going to put all of my vegetables away as well. This process doesn't take me very long because I just refill the tray from everything that we used up over the last couple of weeks, which was pretty much everything. So yeah, I'm going to be quiet and finish up this food prep. Alrighty, you guys i'm not showing myself right now because we just came back this was literally like an impromptu stop at the store for like one item and they didn't have the item we were looking for lamb they didn't have any so we went ahead and pulled up picking up a couple items and it's a little bit more than a couple stuff but it's all good it's all good so let's go ahead and get into what we got here so all of this came from sam's club which we probably go back on um when we go in to actually get our groceries in the next few days to see if they have lamb who knows so I've been seeing these, you guys, as like a close second taste just like Chick-fil-A. So we got some of the sandwiches, just the regular. They did have the spicy in both. But we got the regular sandwich, uh, breaded chicken breast filet sandwich. And then we also got the chicken breast with rib meat nuggets. So we're going to see how these go because my son really likes the chicken nuggets from there. Well, who am I kidding? I do too. So we got these two. We have a garden vegetable pizza. Um, I don't know how it's gonna taste, but I like veggie pizzas. So we got one of those. I got paper cups because I, I look, sometimes I don't wanna do dishes. Let me be honest with you guys. I don't wanna do dishes all the time. Got some paper cups with some plastic cups. We got some butter bread uh, because my husband was trying to make sandwiches with that brioche bread and I guess it was too thick. <laughs> so we got some butter bread. He got some more danishes. You guys know he likes those. Um, we're pretty much just the outside. He eats around the middle. He doesn't really care for that. We have some mini guacamole cups. 
Um, there are 14 in here. He got chips and things as well because he likes guacamole. Paper plates. You guys, these lasted us for a really long time. We originally bought them for like Thanksgiving or something and we just got done using them all up. We got more paper plates. Over here we have some fully cooked turkey sausage. We're gonna see how this tastes. I've never had it before, um, but my husband wanted some sausage and he wanted to try some that wasn't pork. So we got full, uh, fully cooked turkey sausage patties. Then he hasn't had these in a while and he also wanted some of these. So these are the crescent rolls, the 32 pack, which is a lot of them. He almost had to get two. I was like, do not get two because it's 32 of them. We're gonna be eating these for a while. Then this, these are non bites. So, um, like a month or two ago, we actually went and got Indian food. And um, they had these, the bigger ones of these in there. So my husband wanted to try these and see if they taste the same. And then we have three bags of chips. We have the classic Lay's. We had some classic Lay's. We still have some of them left, but that was the saltiest bag of Lay's I've ever had in my life. I'm talking you eat one chip and your whole face goes to pucker face. So we got some more Lay's. We have some original wavy Lay's. These are for his guacamole, I'm sure. Um, and then I got some Cheeto Puffs. I've been eating hot Cheeto Puffs. My son wants some of them. And I used to give him these regular Cheeto Puffs before. And um, now he's been into the Puffs again. So we got some Cheeto Puffs. So this is the stuff we got from Sam's, you guys. I know the lighting isn't that great because I don't have my lights or anything on. But I want to show you guys this before we put it away because it's probably going to get eaten before I, we actually get our groceries in a couple days. So impromptu Sam's Club haul. <laughs> So I will see you guys in a couple days. Alrighty guys, so we are back from Sam's Club for the second time. They still did not have lamb, but that's okay. We're just gonna go ahead and figure it out some other way. Ignore my shrunken, shrunken hair. I'm gonna do it. I promise, I promise. My little ponytail done shrunk up through the whole day. We've been out all day and my hair just went. It was like real big, now it's like, I'm like a cotton tail. Anywho, I'm gonna show you guys what we got from Sam's really quickly. Uh, yeah. Let's look at it. All right, you guys, we're gonna start down here. This is a boneless lamb leg. We were looking for the ones we normally get the slices, um, but they have not had them like at all lately. So we went ahead and got just the leg of lamb. I'm gonna slice it. I'm gonna see if they have some um, somewhere else. And if they do, it'll be in here, but leg of lamb, some pineapples for my honey. I like them too. So they did have the slices of pineapples at Sam's Day. They were also doing fresh squeezed orange juice, but we, Oh, you got orange juice, so I just didn't get any. But pineapple slices. We have some strawberries. They have been looking really good lately, you guys. So I'm excited to go ahead and slice these bad boys down and get them put away. I also got a thing of blackberries. You guys, like, I, I like to have fruit every day. So got all of this stuff, which is good stuff. I'm excited about it. Peanut butter. All the peanut butter that we had just bought, which was four. We go through this much peanut butter, all of these, in about a month. Um, between the peanut butter sandwiches and my son eats it in his oatmeal, we go through a lot of peanut butter. And that's not including the peanut butter soup that I make. Um, so these are for oatmeal and sandwiches. We got peanut butter, some more Hawaiian sweet rolls because I really like Hawaiian sweet rolls, especially with my honey grills or with dinner in general. I like a good Hawaiian sweet roll. Over there, we have some hefty ultra strong trash bags. Let me just get close. Some hefty ultra strong trash bags as well as some Reynolds wrap because we are legit low on all of these things so we got more of both and then over here we have some pure moist uh, contact solution as you guys probably saw my glasses are a little bit different we just went in and got our eyes retested over the last couple of weeks and our glasses are now in as well as my contacts so i Decided to get some more contact solution. They give you some, you know, when you get your eyes done, when you get them tested, but it's like a little, little tiny thing. So I got two more um, contact, the uh, two more things of contact solution. Tylenol, my honey played ball for the first time. You guys, like a year. <laughs> he, needs, he needs some pain meds. Okay, we are, we are not the same whippersnappers we used to be. So got some extra spin Tylenol as well as some Mucinex because. Me and my son sleep when it really cold, and my husband sometimes catches a cold from it. The non, nan, non, I think it's non. My husband really liked these that he bought last time. He's not even finished with them yet, but he wanted some more, so he bought some more of those. We got two full racks of ribs because that's probably what we're about to eat right now. Um, as I am not feeling like cooking, we have been out since the butt crack of dawn, you guys, and it's like two, two, about to be three in the afternoon. It's like it's hot, the sun is draining us, so. We're gonna probably eat these here ribs really quickly. 
Um, and then I got some roses. I got kind of the white ones this time. Um, I was gonna get a different kind, but I don't know. I don't know how um, how some flowers do. Like I've, I've learned pretty much roses, but I hadn't learned a whole lot of the other ones. So I didn't want to get them all messed up. Alrighty, you guys, I'm not sure if this is gonna be the beginning or the end of the video. Cause we still hadn't gone to Walmart yet. It just be so people-y out. When it's, when it's a lot of people out, I just, I just don't want to do it. I don't want to do it. I just want to go back in the house and wait if nobody's outside. So <laughs> I'm going to go to Walmart. I'll show you guys that stuff as well. As I'm going to go somewhere else. I'm not sure where we're going to go yet. Because I may end up going to Target. I mean Kroger. We'll figure it out. But when I figure it out, I'll let y'all know. So I'll see y'all then. Okay, you guys. So I just went to Target and Walmart and bought more stuff than I was supposed to buy. I'm not going to show you all that because all of it ain't grocery related or, you know, house stuff. Um, anywho, I picked up myself some more hot Cheeto puffs from Target. This stuff up here on the front is all Target. Those two items in the back are Walmart. But I got myself some more flaming hot Cheeto puffs because I really like them. Then I got some cranberry grape juice. I just wanted some cranberry grape juice. I was going to get um, grapefruit juice, but they didn't have the grapefruit juice that I normally would drink. So I got cran grape. Then we got the unsweetened dried mangoes because y'all know we eat these. Like, they're our snack. This is the go-to snack at my house. So I got four packs of them because that's all they had. Well, they had five, but I didn't want to take all of them, so I left one. Um, and then I also got some potatoes because I'm going to make dinner tonight, and I wanted something with potatoes, and we didn't have any potatoes. When I went to order some from Walmart, they didn't have any potatoes. So I got another little bag of potatoes. This is a smaller bag than normal for me, um, and the potatoes are smaller as well. So I'm going to have to use like three or four of them for us at one sitting. But uh, it's all good. I'm going to use them up anyway, so it'll make a difference. And then I'm going to go over here to the other side. And over here on the other side, you guys, we have a step stool for my little one. He is getting to where he's trying to step up onto the counter to brush his teeth and wash his face and brush his hair. So I can see in the mirror. And it's been difficult. We have a step stool, but it's a little bit shorter than this one, I believe. And so this one should be really good to help him get a little bit higher over the sink. And then we got some easy ups from Pampers. We have been using the pull ups. But unfortunately, we got this last box and there were like um, some hard little granules or something. It was really hard in the bottom of the pull up and our little one hated it. It was like every time he sat down, he started to scream. I didn't know what was going on and I went and checked all of them and that whole box, the bottom of them were one half of the pack. The bottom of them had those little knots in them and they were super uncomfortable for him. So we went ahead and picked these up for him. This is a 4T, 5T, which is great because I believe they go up to 67 or 5T, 6T. And since we have a bigger little man, <laughs> even though he's big, he's not older and he's not potty trained. And normally kids at this size would be like almost potty trained or close. Um, but we're working on it with him. But again, he's only two. So normally... They wouldn't be in a 4T, 5T, but seeing as how our kid is like not the average size kid for his age, we went ahead and got these 4T, 5Ts to try and see if he likes these. And then we know that we can move up to a 5T, 6T in the future if he needs, if he likes these a lot. And he's a fan of PJ Masks right now. He was so excited looking at the box in the cart. So this was pretty good, especially this was $26 or $25 for this. And the little step stool was 11 So it's not too bad of a buy for our little man. Alrighty, you guys, that concludes my grocery haul for the two weeks. I hope you all enjoyed this video. Please let me know what you think down in the comment section below. I want to thank you all again so much for watching. And if you are new here, please subscribe before you go. I would love that. I do everything motherhood lifestyle, a little bit of beauty when I can. Sometimes I try. I try. And I post on Mondays and Fridays at 4.30 p.m. Central Standard Time. And to my returners, guys, thank you so much. Thank you so much for helping me grow. Thank you so much for being supportive. Just thank you guys. You are the absolute best. You are a blessing. Thank you. Um, and if you haven't, you're just floating through watching this video, please don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. <laughs> I'll see you all in my next video. Bye guys.